In this video, I'm going to use the WebLoad IDE to perform SOAP load testing. I'm going to test the web service that provides you with zip code information. So let's take a look at the web service. This web service provides information by area code, by city, by state, and by zip. I'm going to open up all of these web service calls. The first one is get information by area code. There's get info by city, get info by state, and get info by zip. I'm going to copy the endpoint. I'm going to open WebLoad IDE, create a new project. In my toolbox, I'll go to Web Services. I'm going to drag and drop WSDL to my agenda tree. I'm going to paste in the WSDL and the URL. I'll click on Parse WSDL. I'll look at my SOAP Web Services, and I'm going to add the Get Info by Zip. This Web Service call expects a US zip, so I'll look at my headers. I need to add a key of US zip. And for a zip code, I'll type 27519, and then I'll click OK. So in my JavaScript view, you can see that we have a SOAP action in the header. We have the US zip, which would be the parameter. The data type is text XML. There's a value that's going to be sent back, and there's a post action. I need to modify the SOAP envelope. So I'm going to scroll over a little bit. I need to replace the question mark with my zip code. I'm going to add some more whistles to the agenda tree. I'm going to paste in my whistle again and I'll put it as the URL. I'll click on Parse Wisdle. I'll open up the US Zip Soap, and I'll add Get Info by City. I'm going to change my city, and here I'll type Rally, and I'll click OK. I'm going to add one more Wisdle. Once again, I'm going to paste in the Wisdle address and my URL. I'll click Parse, open up US Zip Soap, and I'll add Get Info by State. For the state, I'll type NC, and I'll hit OK. I'm going to add one more WSDL. I'll paste in the address for my WSDL and the URL. I'll click Parse WSDL, open up US Zip Soap, and get info by area code. For my area code, I'll type 919, and I'll hit OK. So now, I'm going to try running my test. I won't save this, so my test ran, and it passed in three seconds. I'm going to look at the execution tree, and I'll go to Page View, and I got back a list of cities with this area code. I'll click on the next web service call. I'll go back to JavaScript view. So this is get info by state. In the page view, you can see all the cities that are in North Carolina. I'll click on the next node. This is get info by city. So I typed in Raleigh, and you can see the information for Raleigh, Illinois, Raleigh, Missouri, Raleigh, North Carolina, and also Raleigh, North Dakota, and Raleigh, West Virginia. I'll click on the last node. Go back to JavaScript view. This is get info by zip, and the zip code was 27519, and this zip code is for Cary, North Carolina.